Hi, so here uh, now we will going to discuss about the masters in computer science in here UCC. So how is the masters uh, in computer science and what are the different subjects, what are different assignments and how you can pass that particular thing. So yeah, first of all, uh, as you can see on your screen, uh, these are the uh, like uh, core subjects that you need to compulsory attend uh, in your first semester and second semester. and. Uh, these are compulsory and uh, these are the three subjects or for first semester and three subjects for second semester and uh, rest of the three subjects for the first semester you can choose from this particular modules and uh, rest of the th uh, three subjects for second semester you can choose from this particular modules uh, so these are the subjects uh, you can choose uh, three subjects on your first semester as per your convenience and you just need to do assignments and all the mid semester and final exams in order to pass these particular subjects now talking about the uh, assignments so assignments are always on practical basis so whatever you will study on your subjects assignments will be based on that particular study only so you need to compulsory attend uh, lectures in order to like do that particular assignments now talking about the workload for the computer science uh, so workload will be uh, really high because see uh, if you will talk about the timetable then you will have a uh, lectures from like monday to friday and per day it might be possible that you have a lecture in morning and then uh, you don't have a lecture in afternoon and again you have a lecture in like evening so uh, and in next day it might be possible that you have a lecture in morning to evening continuously so sometimes you have lectures uh, like two or three lectures in a day sometimes it might be possible that you have only one lecture in a day for one hour and sometimes it might be possible that you have a lecture for five hours a day so it will be completely depend on your subjects that uh, you have chosen so yeah that's the main thing now uh, talking about the attendance so it is not compulsory to attend all the lectures if you are not uh, ready to attend that particular thing so you might skip uh, lectures if you want to if you will miss uh, one of the lectures then the timeline going on uh, for that particular subject will be missed so you need to actually attend all the lectures uh, day by day and uh, in order to get like uh, involved into the study so that is the main thing uh, you need to like keep in mind um, there is uh, nothing uh, say, a strict rule like uh, if you are in India then in uh, some universities uh, like uh, when I was in India in my university there was a uh, like rule that you need to uh, get at least 60% attendance in order to pass your subjects but here it is not like that uh, you can just uh, go into your lecture if you want to if you don't want to go then no one will tell you anything you can just skip your lectures uh now talking about the exams so there will be two exams so one is mid semester and one is final so if you will start your semester uh, let's consider if you are starting your semester in september then your mid sem will be on november like starting of the one november uh, and your final exam will be at the mid of the december so uh, at the december after like uh, 15 or uh, max 20 you will be free from your first semester you will complete your first semester and next year in february you will get your results so for example if you will start your semester in the september 2020 then your mid semester will be on november 2020 and final will be on december mid december 2020 and uh, your result will be like in february 2021 so this is the complete timeline of your uh, study computer science now talking about the uh, uh, professors and the staff over here in ucc and the facilities they provide for uh, computer science students so all the professors and staffs are highly qualified and they have uh, like good knowledge in that particular field whatever they are uh, doing over here professors are highly qualified you don't need to worry about that particular thing and they are really good in behavior if you have any problem if you have any queries you can just ask them anytime you can just send them mail or you can uh, sometimes it might be possible that you, you don't have a time then you can just walk into their offices and you can just get the answers from there now talking about the facility then yeah uh, you will get all the facilities uh, whatever you want like if you will go to computer lab then yes uh, there are latest computers everything will be there and if you will go to let's consider iOS lab then yes 
you have all the macbook over there you can just use them as per your convenience they will just provide your idea password of your personal you can just log in with them and start using that particular thing no one will uh, tell you anything so yeah this is the masters uh, in computer science here in ucc so these are the things that you need to like uh, keep in mind that uh, attendance is not compulsory but you need to attend the lecture in order to like enroll into the study and in order to do your assignments so that is the main thing so yeah that's it for this particular video i hope you like this particular video if you have any other problems or queries you can do make a comment down below i will answer over there